Is the death inside the... I don't know, the sink. I don't know how it's still remaining. You still need more? Ha! Is there anything on that side? There's been a lot compared to what I saw. There's not just two planting. No, I made it three. Okay, makes sense. Because the way you were threatening me. Mm -hmm. I had to make it three. Very really nice, thank you. To work. Hey, God. Hey, hey. The cold was too much this afternoon. I had to go and take another duty. Okay. Cold is even still too much. I think I need to start wearing socks. Yes, Bella, feeling like a princess, feeling like a queen, like uh, Rachel was really in a good mood today. And uh, Rachel was just so calm. Rachel was just, you know, petting Bella, treating her like a baby, you know, serving her, making sure she's fine, making sure she's okay, even asking if the food was enough. Like if the food wasn't enough, she'd have just gone and, you know, and get her more food for her to eat and be fine. Like the vibes, the vibes I'm seeing this night is really, really making me like feel happy for all these people. They are very, very united. Like I wish that the house will always be like few people. Like it would have been very, very sweet though. Guys, it would have been very, very sweet, but just that we will not see a lot of drama. We'll not see the bass girls will not see the real you know we won't, we won't get to see their real character their real self because you have to mingle with a lot of different people both the ones that are toxic to be able to get you know to get what you want to get up to get the person to like bring out or show his real personality what he really is in real life so but you see like this finally is they are just living so so united nobody is fighting everybody is just happy bella is happy Richard is happy, Fina is happy, Chizzy, Adekunle, Brian, everybody are just, you know, they're just happy. They're just feeling like more, they're just giving me this brother and sister's vibes in the house. I really, really enjoy this one. Like, I don't know if it is the, um, if it is this girl's, if it is um, Daniela's birthday, whether that is showing or, you know, bringing out all this beautiful love that i'm seeing here like i'm really happy with what i'm seeing so guys like bella is feeling like a princess i don't even know what to say again like i don't know what to say the food is really nice it's really really nice look at the both of them on the bed eating it together enjoying their meal and just eating and all of that anyway is this on the shower we'll see we shall wait let's see wait and see how it goes okay here so guys there's a very quick um interview with um Chomzi from Pause, Pause, whatever. Uh, it, Chomzi, they are they called Chomzi out to ask her some question after Groovy, you know, came out of the house. So the, this question was asked by and to was asked directly to Chomzi, asking Chomzi that what does she think now that Groovy is out of the house? Like, but guys. Chomzi did not really, really love um, Groovy. The person she actually loved there was Elo Swago. Not even Groovy, but Groovy is really, really in love with that girl. Dying for herself, not even in love. Anyway, so they asked um, um, Chomzi this question. What did she think about Groovy now? Groovy and um, Fina. And what did she think about Bella and Shay? Did she think that Groovy will go, will wait for Bella? Do you think their relationship is all nice and everything? She said for Bella and Shay that their relationship is real genuine but for fina and groovy she don't know because she's not in their she's not in their level that way and that much and she don't really know about them that much but she knows that um their relationship might kind of crash uh, her, but she does she won't say anything about that that's the way she said it though she will not say anything about that she'll just keep candid I ask her okay now that he is out can she, if he comes for her, will she go for him? She said no. And they asked her now, what about Eloswa? What does she think about him? And what made her love and like Eloswa? She said, one, he's very caring. He listens to her. You know, he talks to her. He plays with her. He's, and he can dance. And all of these sweet, sweet words. That was what um, Chumzi said. And... That was it, actually who she is, and that's what she said. So, but the comment I got from that interview, like it was, they really bad mouthed this girl. They really, really poured in salt on her. They said she was just feeling herself. She was just for me. She the way she was replying, she was replying with pride and everything. Like it was a lot of big. But I'll just drop one comment for you guys. 
Okay, yeah, madam, if you want to go far in life, drop some pride. Hey, he help you in the house because you didn't know anything even to read. No problem for you. Is a cute is a cute cake last is a cute cake last god i beg for me anyway guys that is it for you so i don't know what you think about it but let me know what you think in the comment section as i see you back on my next video thank you so much for watching